So the inspiration behind the Thari is the Thar itself. Uh, you know, the love it gets, the iconic status it has. Uh, the Inglo architecture has, has certain differences from, let's say, an ice-based uh, architecture. And that's normal, right? Because they're two fundamentally different uh, approaches to, to the platform. So this allows us to do bigger wheels because you know it has it can have a different turning circle radius, very very uh, tight overhangs. But what is important and what I really like that the design team have done is they've infused some intelligence into into mm. this. It's mm. not just a styling exercise. If you look at the lamps, it's the same lamp used four times. Mm. If you look at the bu front bumper, it's also the rear bumper. Mm. If you look at the side step, it's also left and right. Mm. If you look at the the, the fenders. Mm. They are also so. There's a larger story to this, you know, in terms of investment, in terms of inventory, in terms of supply chain, in terms of waste, mm. you know. So it's not just a, let's say, a style exercise in that sense. So what we've said is, you know, our Inglo architecture currently conceived does 60 kilowatt hour and 80 kilowatt hour. This will obviously be the 80 kilowatt hour, and uh, it will also be the twin motor version of the Inglo. Uh, if we ever did that, you know, that's a minimum a, a Thar Electric would, would need, right? Mm -hmm. All-wheel drive mm -hmm. and, like you said, a larger battery for more range. Mm -hmm. But yeah, this is a little bit of the example of what I was saying, you know, the, the bumpers, the lamps, this modularity, this, mm -hmm. this, this less is more thinking mm -hmm. is also very core to the, the Thar name. Right. But it still creates a hugely emotional response in whoever sees, you know, a Thar ice or hopefully the Thar EV. Okay. Oh, uh, and 20, 27 is not a date we've given, uh, but were we to do it, you know, like I said, the, the architecture is pretty stable now. Inglo, you saw the prototypes running on our track at MSPT. Uh, but if we were to do it, I don't think it would be a million miles from this. You know, we have a very capable design and engineering team. And in all our products, actually, we try to stay as close to a concept should we make it.